Welcome back to this week's installment of Sports Corner. I'm Cole Young, and a whole lot has happened in the world of sports, so I'll get right to it. I've been repeatedly saying it for weeks, but the NFL season has finally begun. Yesterday night, the season kicked off between the Buffalo Bills and the LA Rams. This year's Super Bowl favorite Bills were able to take down the reigning champ Rams in an electric game to start the season. As I said last week, I still believe that the Super Bowl this season will be between the Bills and the Rams, so we'll return to that prediction a little bit down the road. Speaking of predictions, I thought for the NFL season, every week I will give three or four predictions of which teams I believe will win for the week. So for week one, here are my winners. The 49ers will beat the Chicago Bears. The Baltimore Ravens will get a win against the New York Jets. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers will repeat their last year week one win over the Cowboys. And Russell Wilson will get his revenge and lead the Broncos to victory over the Seahawks. Throughout the weeks, I'll check back on my current record and see how many predictions I can get right. Unless, of course, I lose every single one, in which case I might have to rethink my strategy. While the NFL season is just beginning, a few other sports are coming to a close. The WNBA season is quickly wrapping up this weekend as well. The Las Vegas Aces have secured their spot in the finals and will be facing off against the Connecticut Sun. The Aces punched their spot in the finals after taking down the legendary Sue Bird and the Seattle Storm. After 20 years, Bird has decided to call it a career. The 2002 number one overall draft pick went on to become the WNBA's all-time leader in both assists, with over 3,000, and career starts with 549, and the only player in the league to have appeared in 500 career games. She's won four WNBA championships and participated in a record 12 All-Star games, and also won five consecutive Olympic gold medals for the U.S. women's basketball team. Sue Bird will go down as one of the best basketball players of all time, and we wish her all the best in retirement. Another legend has reached the end of her career in the tennis world. A few weeks back, it was announced that Serena Williams will be retiring from the sport of tennis. Williams' final match on Friday in round three of the US Open became the most watched tennis match ever on ESPN, drawing 4.6 million viewers. Williams was defeated at the Open, and an emotional scene took place afterwards as Serena exited the court one final time. Considering she has won 23 Grand Slam titles, 71 singles titles, and spent 319 weeks ranked number one in the world, she has an abundance of career achievements to reflect on and be proud of. Serena Williams will always be known as one of the best and most influential athletes to ever take any court or field, and fans around the world are excited to follow her in her next adventure in life. Enjoy week one of the NFL this weekend, and tune in Saturday to some intense college football. We got treated to some incredible games just last weekend. I will be traveling next week, so be sure to tune in to the next episode of Sports Corner two weeks from today. I'm Cole Young. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you next time.